So it's uh, about 8.30 in the morning. I am having a little bit of breakfast, just some cinnamon bread, some yogurt. I'm gonna go watch a dirt track race on January 30th, and I ain't in Florida. No, this is Tennessee. They're doing some dirt track races out of Knoxville, Tennessee. Well, Seymour, Tennessee, technically, at 411 Motor Speedway. I've never been to 411. As long as I was at the University of Tennessee, I had no clue 411 was that close. I've been to Tazewell Speedway. That's the one closer to my house, but I never went to 411, so this should be interesting. This race was supposed to have been held on January 1st, but with an, with an expected high of 25 degrees and a low of like 6, they decided to move it to Saturday where it's still cold but not quite that cold so yeah let's go throughout the entire day so one thing that i'm gonna do when i'm down there at 411 is i have something right here and i'm gonna come into the nascar area in my room i have here a custom 124 scale die cast if i can get it in my hand just right awkward yeah here it is so this is actually a die cast replica of one of ray cook's number 53 cars it was actually made though because of the fact that chase elliott once drove it back in like 2013 i think uh but ray cook is gonna hopefully be there since he won the race last year so i assume he's gonna be back but eventually i'd like to get chase and ray to sign this so i'm gonna try to get ray to sign it today so that'll be fun to do. And another thing, since it's still early in the morning, we have work to do over here at the computer real fast. I got a video I gotta put up real fast. And then I will start getting ready to head down to Knoxville. Stay productive in the mornings and we're gonna go have some fun. All right, so I just got my video put up and I am showered, dressed, and I'm ready to go. I've got some coveralls over here. I've got the box for that diecast car and some gloves and a portable charger for my phone because Probably be on it a lot. I'm ready to go. Let's go watch some racing in Knoxville. So I'm wanting to get this diecast car signed by Ray Cook if I can find him. But I was looking all over for my gray Sharpie and I didn't even see it. So I'm going to have to stop by like a Dollar General or something on my way back and see if I can find one. So I just stopped at the Dollar General by Norris Lake, a little out of Tazewell, Tennessee. They have Sharpies, but not the kind that I need. I'm needing like a silver Sharpie. I don't know why I figured Dollar General might have that. The only other thing I can think of is I know that there's a there's a Walgreens on my way. They might possibly have it. Made it into the Knoxville area and we are on our way. Should be about 30 more minutes. Kind of make me hungry though. Oh well.
as you can hear there's still a lot of more racing going you can hear it in the background back there there's more late models going around guys the 411 motor speedway hangover event was a great race in my opinion i'm pretty satisfied with my trip up here i did get to meet uh, mr ray cook and got his autograph thank you ray overall it was a great experience talked to a lot of great other fans out there got to know some drivers that actually go up my local track so i can recognize them next time i go back up there cold but good thing that they pushed it forward a couple days because uh, the day that they were supposed to have this was going to be like 20 something degrees so it's probably for the best that that happened anyways yeah i would come back again i'll definitely come back to 411 this is my first trip up here if you ain't really had a chance to go experience a dirt track race y'all need to because it's a lot of fun stopped and got me some Panda Express, which was pretty nice. I love Panda Express. I don't get it that much now I'm not in college no more. I still like to get it every now and again. Today was a good day for it. Today was overall a fun day. I feel like that was a good, like, daycation I really needed for myself. I hate that it was just me, but, you know, I'll have company again in the future. So, but yeah, I got my racing fix in for a while, and I'll be good until uh, February when Atlanta Motor Speedway comes around. All right. Let's keep on driving home. I'm on the final little bit of this drive in Tazewell, Tennessee. Yeah, at this point, I'm just I'm just tired. I'm ready to just lay down and rest my eyes for a little bit. Let's go in here to the post office and get my mail. didn't give me a key now I'm wondering what that is well I was expecting something in the mail but I thought it'd be something where they just gave me a key to one of these extra lockers and they just let me go get it but nope I gotta wait till they open back up Tuesday ah yeah because they're closed for New Year's boo I am now back home and I am very tired uh, it was a fun time down there at uh, 411 Motor Speedway. Uh, great racing. I definitely feel like I got a lot of good footage that will be useful for uh, making this vlog and maybe one other video if I can fit it all in. Probably can. But you, you can tell tiredness is setting in. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, yeah, I'm just gonna just gonna cover up and um, and uh, just gonna go to sleep hope you like this vlog see how many more i make in the future see how many more races i go to take care bye